Hi, welcome back to the channel. This is Tia. Today I have a Bath and Body Works outlet haul. I did post a video of the outlet walkthrough, so please go back and look at that video if you want to see everything that they had in the outlet. So the first item I picked up at the outlet was the Eucalyptus Spearmint Bath Soap. This was $3.50 at the outlet and then I had a 20% off coupon for everything. So the final price on this was $2.80. The original price of this product is $16.50. The next product I got was the Gingham Whipped Body Butter. This was $3.50, $2.80 after the coupon. There was something misprinted on the packaging with this Gingham, so that's how that ended up at the outlet. Um, I know the lady at the store was telling me that um, there was something wrong with, with this packaging, so that's why it was on the clearance table. Next, I picked up the Winter Candy Apple Body Scrub. So Whipped Sugar Body Scrub. This was also $3.50 and with the coupon $2.80. Next, I picked up the Dahlia Body Scrub. This was $3.50, $2.80 after the coupon. And I believe this was at the outlet because at the outlet, sometimes they get international uh, packaging versions. If you can see that there, there's different languages on this packaging. So I believe that is how it ended up at the outlet. Um, next, I picked up two fairy tale mini travel size fine fragrance mist. These were two dollars, a dollar sixty with the coupon. Next, I picked up a mini bonfire bash, and this was a dollar sixty after coupon. And then I also picked up the matching moisturizing body wash, which was $2.80 after the coupon. Um, I also have the body butter that goes with this set. I got from the winter semi-annual sale for 75% off. So I do have the complete set in this. Next, I picked up Sweet Whiskey. It is a shimmer body lotion. I picked this up for my daughter. Um, this product is actually originally $16.50. They don't have the price on here, but um, it is a $16.50 item that I got for $2.80. Next, I picked up the... Snowflakes and Cashmere Diamond Shimmer Mist. I picked this up for my daughter as well. Um, scent notes are Vanilla Cashmere Cream, Caramel Woods, and Frosted Clementine. Uh, this also was $2.80. Uh, next, I got a lot of soaps because they had a whole rack of soaps for $2. So after the coupon, each soap was $1.60. So I did rack up on mini soaps. Now, I wish Bath & Body Works would come back out with the Creamy Luxe soaps. I know that they have Creamy Luxe soaps in, you know, about five cents. But there used to be a time when every season they would come out with Creamy Luxe soaps um, in some of the special seasonal scents. So let's say Christmas time, they came out with new uh, soaps. Let's say 10 new soaps. They would make like four of those scents into like creamy luxe formula. So every season, not only did you have like the same core ones, but then you would also get like some fun seasonal creamy luxe soaps. And Bath & Body Works no longer does this. Um, out of all their formulas, the Creamy Luxe one is 
the best. It is moisturizing. You only need like one pump. Whereas the gentle gel formula, I need two pumps for it to really lather and do what it needs to do. And the, the foaming, um, it lathers pretty well, but it's, it's not as moisturizing as the Creamy Lux formula. So I really wish Bath & Body Works would give us some seasonal Creamy Lux scent, like spring and summer. If you could just, just throw us like three or four Creamy Lux scents, and I would be very happy. When the fall comes around, throw us three or four Creamy Lux scents as well. That would make me very happy um, because that is my favorite formula. But I digress. So let's let's get into the soaps. So the first soap I picked up was Sweater Weather. Scent notes is Sage Eucalyptus in Fresh Woods. Here's the packaging on that again. The next soap I picked up was Fresh Snow. Cool Crisp Air Frozen Pine and Snowy Mint. I picked up Fresh Sparkling Snow. Icy Melon Holiday Pear and Falling Snow. I picked up Champagne Toast. Bubbly Champagne, Sparkling Berries, and Juicy Tangerine. I picked up a Winterberry Ice. Scent notes are Ice Cherries, Juicy Orange, and Snowy Lime. I, I really like this scent. I didn't get this scent uh, during the Christmas season that just passed, but this is a beautiful scent. I really like it. Next, I have Frosted Cranberry in the Gentle Gel Soap. Frosted Cranberry, Red Delicious Apple, and Blonde Wood. Next, I picked up two of this scent because I really enjoyed it. Um, Bright Citrus Sunflower. Scent notes on that are Juicy Mandarin Orange. Golden Sunflower and Sugar Cane. Next, I picked up Winter, which is a holiday tradition. Spiced Orange, Fir Balsam, and Clove Buds. And then lastly, I picked up two of the Pumpkin Apples. And the scent notes on that are red, delicious apples, fall pumpkin, and clove buds. So as I stated, all of the soaps came up to be only a dollar and sixty cents. So I really don't pay full price for Bath and Body Works soaps because I live by an outlet. I, I usually always can luck up on two dollar soaps. And during the semi-annual sale, I usually always find 75% off soaps as well. So, um, you know, $2 with a 20% off coupon is $1.60. During the semi-annual sale, uh, it's $1.87. So, I always pretty much skip all of the soap sales that they have um, because I know that I can go to an outlet or I can go to the semi-annual sale and get hand soap so i usually stock up so all of these fall and winter soaps when the fall and winter come around i'm I'm already stocked up on soaps and so um i'll do that the next in the summertime i will stock up on 75 percent off soaps uh during the june slash july semi-annual sale and um after, even after the semi-annual sale is over, they usually send a lot of stuff to the outlet. So then I'll be able to stock up on some more. So then when next spring and summer roll around, I already am stocked up on soaps and I don't have to pay, you know, high prices. I'm all about, you know, staying within the budget and um, not spending much on luxury. <laughs> you know, like I love their soaps, but... You know, paying seven fifty for a soap, or even when they have a sale and the soaps are like three ninety five, three twenty five, that's still not really a deal to me. Um, so I stock up on them when I see them at a good price, especially when I have a twenty percent off coupon. 
Uh, the candle that I'm burning here is Sugar Snickerdoodle in a single wick. Um, I really enjoy this candle in a single wick. I do not like this candle in a three wick. It is absolutely kind of too strong and it starts smelling like a burnt cookie. But in a single wick, um, it actually is a beautiful scent and it does not give me that burnt sugar cookie smell. This is absolutely beautiful in a single wick in a bedroom. So you do have to burn these in a smaller space, close the door, come back in in like an hour or two and your room will smell like a beautiful cookie. Please don't forget to go back and watch my outlet walkthrough and I would love to have you as a subscriber. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.